temperature from the elements, but there are other ways to stay cool when the mercury soars. Let's say hello to designer Suzanne Dimma. <laughs> Do it. I know. Isn't this amazing? This is amazing. This is welcoming. Imagine you got the shed in the back, you got the day bed going yeah, and on. And check this out. Oh, <laughs> perfect. So, with the UV being insane these days, you need to get out of it and get in the shade, That's right? That's right. So this is perfect. This is from ARD Outdoor. Oh, I'm going to so put it good. down again so I can see you, my dear. Yep. <laughs> um, and what I like about this piece, you've seen the round ones. We've seen them a lot, the round ones, and those round ones are great for tucking into an awkward space. Yes. But I love the rectilinear lines of this one, and two people can get on there and have a really good time. Two people. <laughs> no two problem. Two people plus the dogs. Or two dog. people plus the yes. cats. Or two people plus the the two kids, Absolutely. like you can shove you can them all in there. Everybody on here. You can get, totally. go a little bit less on the pillows and yeah. go more with the people. But the other thing is, you do have to think your, about your pets. And yes. when you were talking about the sheds, I thought the one with the little awning thing out right. of it, the balcony, that's perfect for a dog because a dog can get shade, but you can also go and get a cute little version Aren't of the same the thing as this, thing. but for your dogs. Yes. This is so great. <laughs> Isn't it? I Super love chic. This. Yeah. Super chic. I love it. So there's so many other things you might want to think of when you're trying to cool off on a hot day, Suzanne. We've got more over here. Let's Absolutely. take a look. We all sort of expect a water feature. Yes. You know, that's the smartest way to cool down uh, when it gets super hot out there. So this is a lovely one. I love this one. It's actually made out of concrete, but it looks so much like an old stone one that you might see in a villa in Europe or something. Yes. And I'm going to show you how it works just by flicking this, if I can it's do the it. Calming, it's the calmness of it all, right? And it's so easy. What's so great about it is that it's just an internal pump. That's what I love about fountains. The pump's in there. You pour the water and it just recycles the water. So you don't really have to think about it that much. You don't yes. have to wire it in or plug it in in any way, except for the plug. Yeah. You can put it in a shady spot in your garden because, I'm going to turn it off for a sec. Yeah. Because, um... It's loud and I have to go to the washroom. Yeah. <laughs> I said the same thing before. Um, well, the good thing about it being loud is that it muffles out the oh noise gosh, in the city. So, so they're good. great for urban backyards. Mm -hmm. But the other thing is if you have a shady spot in your backyard where nothing's growing, put it there because then you're oh. filling in that dead spot with something that adds another function. And they're gorgeous to look at. Yes. Now, the other thing I want to talk about are the plants. Yes. Because you can do so many things with your plants in your backyard to make the space feel cooler. Mm -hmm. Things like ivy on your fence will go a long, a long way to make the space feel cooler. But I was talking to um, a florist and they said one of the tricks is to actually plant with really cool toned plants. Okay. So things in purples and whites and the greens and that's exactly what we've done here. They will make you feel like you're in a shade garden right. and make the whole space feel cooler. And even the planters going with cool colors. So stay away from like the, the hot reds, mm -hmm. yellows, the oranges if you want your space to feel cooler and stick with like the green ceramic pods instead of the terracotta pots. Nice. And that will go, it will actually add a little bit of help with keeping it feeling cooler. That's really lovely. Isn't that cool? Yes. I thought that Plants was cool. work over time. They work <laughs> they over do so time. Much. And, and they so make you feel good. They make you feel yeah. good. Like they're really serving a purpose. Yeah. That's great. I like this Isn't this insane? Thing. I like love whatever this that is. It looks very cool. <laughs> it's crazy. I know. It's quite funny. It's from Amazon. It's a mister. This is called a mister. Ah. So what it does, is, and you can sit it on the ground like this, or you can play with it and have like a little game yeah. of whatever. Um, it sprays out a mist. Okay. And it sprays it out for about 10 feet, this one. You can get different lengths. Mm -hmm. And that will actually actually they say bring the temperature of your yard down by up to 20 degrees which wow. is kind of crazy that's so incredible. if you just want an instant cool feeling you turn that on and it has the double benefit of watering your plants mm -hmm. and your kids can run through it yeah. and you can line them up and make a fun little art display as well if you want very so these nice are very cool aren't they I well, love that. It, looks, it just looks so much nicer than the sprinklers we used yeah. to run through it, and kids. it attaches to your hose so yeah. it's really really easy to set up very cool yeah we've got a picture now yeah. of a fan, a fan that you might want to consider yes. So take a look at this. Yes. This is going to keep you cool if yeah. you've got that covered porch happening yeah. outside. Exactly. So and I just like the, I like the way it looks. I know. It's got that it's kind like of, it feels very southern, doesn't it? Yes. Because these look like palm leaves. Now, when you're choosing your fan, this one's also from Amazon. You want to make sure that it is for use outside as well as inside. So certified mm -hmm. for outdoor use, which this one is. Um, they're great for just keeping the air moving because you get stagnant air on a porch or any kind of semi-enclosed space. Yeah. You could also put this inside your screened in porch and the other thing is they'll keep the bugs at bay they kind of yes. blow the bugs away so that's an added benefit of having them yeah and you can get them there's so many styles now you can get them in white so if your ceilings white you, it'll blend in and disappear or go for something like this oil rub bronze finish and it'll 
stand out and make a statement. That's lovely. Yeah, it's fun, right? Now, umbrellas are the sort of things yes. that we, uh, you need them for on a practical level just to stop that shade, especially if you're in a yard and that sun is beating down and you're trying to have a meal. Yeah. So many great umbrellas on the market so many. these days. Well, the good thing is that they're available at so many different price points. We have one that's very affordable. Yes, the gray one. Yeah, gray, simple gray color palette, which will go with everything. Yes. But this one, which is an investment yeah. from Jardin de Ville, is super cool. So I want to show you how it works. Okay. So you just pull up one of the arms. I love that. Because how many of us have been in that situation where you're wrestling with you it, can't wrestling get it up. with it, you're getting plucked in the <laughs> eye, you're trying to open yeah. it up. Now you just take one arm and it yeah. does it on its it own. It does it on its own. And what's Very great cool. about this is that the base is solid. integrated with it's solid. It's not gonna go anywhere. I think people often think, oh my umbrella's gonna fly away down the beach or whatever. Right. Or into the other part of the yard. But it's got yeah. a really solid base, they're attached together, it's gonna stay put. Yes. Um, and I love the simple sleek design as well. It's gorgeous. So I'm gonna try and bring it down. Here we go. <laughs> God. <laughs> You're smart. Isn't that cool? So smart. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's talk about um, other things you might want to consider when you're outside and other umbrellas that are out there. Because now you have like double well, umbrellas. Well, I saw this one and I thought, this is so cool. This is on Wayfair yeah. and it's a three-in-one. And I've never seen that. I was like, Me well, neither. for like really huge patio spaces or if you're having a party and you've got lots yes. of people, you can protect everyone. Because, you know, there's always that one person that's sort of hanging <laughs> off and like <laughs> melting. Right. This way, everyone's got shade. We yeah. also have uh, different awning, awning ideas for you out there yeah. because because um, this is a great way to achieve some shade. I love awnings. Uh, I actually have an awning now in my new place and I'd never had one before and I adore it. And yeah. what I like about it, that one especially with the stripes, it's so yes. classic. It adds a decorating element to your yard as well, like a little pattern hit. Nice. And I, I know at home I love seeing the little flange, it's very pretty. But now they have so many styles. There's a simple modern one that has no flange and just a metal bar at the edge, yeah. which looks really clean and contemporary. And then you can buy individual ones for one window. So if That's you have right. one window, window in your house that gets tons and tons of light and you just need to cut it put just it on, put it on, on the one, one window and that one's a standing seam metal one yeah. so it's really sturdy and can deal with tons of gusts of wind that's one tip I would say is that when you're choosing your awning if you're in a really windy place yes there's some designs where you can specify I need this to deal with really high winds and it has an automatic sensor that'll pull it in when oh, the winds get too high good. yeah that is cool. very good I want to mention uh, that this gorgeous fountain is from uh, Summer Hill Nursery and the dog bed we saw a little bit earlier is from from Home Sense, as well, the smaller umbrella over there, the gray one, is from Canadian Tire. So thank you so much for all thank these great you. ideas. Let's